Well, some local kids are facing off tonight once again in the finale of a cooking contest called the Young Chef Challenge, a culinary showdown between kids from the YMCA teen program and the Good Fight Community Center. News 19's Heather Armstrong joins us now live from Western Technical College where the students are putting the final touches on their meal. So Heather, how's it going tonight? Well, Dustin, first of all, I know you love to cook. I do, too. Imagine being in a kitchen like this. This is amazing. We are down to the wire. These kids have until 5.15. Their food has to come out. Check out the vegetables. I mean, is that not amazing? You know what they say? Teamwork makes the dream work. Everybody has a role. Okay, that's the YMCA team. Now we got the good fight. Check this out. They are plating scallops, and this is lamb. So they are not choosing easy things. And we're going to come over here. We're going to talk with someone who works with youth in La Crosse County. Diana, um, you wanted to come and see how this works. Why would something like this be beneficial to kids? This is an amazing program. We've been talking so much about youth mental health. This program is really addressing that and that it's giving youth the life skill of learning to cook, of giving them self-efficacy and the self-confidence that they can do something for themselves and yes. impress and, you know, and, and for their families. And um, yeah, it's just I a great need to event. ask you this. Um, you said that you send out surveys to the kids in the school. They get to take it anonymously. I would think what is the biggest issue with our youth right now? I think social connection. And so that's why, again, like this, this event is amazing in that the kids are interacting with adult mentors. They're making friendships with themselves. They're, they're just you know, having a great time and learning a new skill. All right, so are cell phones playing a huge role in some problems that we're having? For sure, yes. Social okay. media, the uh, being on, on cell phones, not being able to um, okay. know how to talk about their mental health. I have seen, thank you so much for your time, I have seen such amazing growth in these students. Uh, some of them didn't even want to say hi in the beginning, and now we're having these great conversations. But we've got Chef Zach here. You were on the Gordon Ramsay show. Um, you placed very well. Tell us what this cooking experience could do for our youth. Uh, this cooking experience is a great opportunity for all the youth uh, cooking you're going to learn a lot about teamwork here. You're going to learn a life skill, and you're also going to learn um, how to make some really good food. Absolutely. Thank you so much. And your dream, his dream was actually, if, if he won, and you did pretty darn good, um, was to get a food truck and hire at-risk youth. And I know you're going to go on and pursue something fabulous. Anyway, Dustin, it smells delicious in here, and I think they've got a few more minutes, so we got to get out of the way. Oh, well, enjoy it for us this evening, Heather, of course. Coming together over food, a great way to bring people together and foster that social connection. Also, The Good Fight is hosting their third annual golf outing on June 25th. Registration for that is $60, and you can learn more by finding The Good Fight Community Center over on Facebook.